Now let us start with the second part of the brain that is midbrain. As the name suggests, midbrain is situated in the middle part of the brain. This midbrain is very small and it comprises of four small lobes and corpora quadrigemina. This corpora quadrigemina consists of two pairs of colliculi. The superior part of corpora quadrigemina are called superior colliculi. Which are two in number. That is occurs in pair. And the inferior part is known as inferior colliculi. It also occurs in pair. The main function of superior colliculi that it receives impulses from the eyes and muscles of head which controls the reflexes and definitely its action and the function of inferior colliculi is that it receives impulses from the ears and head muscle and controls the auditory reflexes. Thus, Superior colliculi is associated with the visual effect and inferior is associated with the auditory one. Now, the third and the last part of the brain is hindbrain. It is situated posteriorly or posterior part of the brain. comprised of three parts
host cerebellum second pons virali and third medulla oblongata first cerebellum this part is considered as very large and well developed part of the brain This cerebellum basically consists of two large lateral parts that is cerebral hemisphere and a small dermis the cerebellum layer is solid and has branching tree like structure consisting of white matter which is surrounded by a sheath of gray matter The function of the cerebellum is that it controls various muscular activities Now these activities can include many like running talking or typing Second part pons virali This structure is an oval mass which mainly consists of nerve fibers. And bridges the cerebral hemisphere and medulla oblongata that is a connection between the two is formed with the help of pons virali that is it relays the impulses between both medulla oblongata and cerebral hemisphere apart from that it also relays impulses between cerebrum and cerebellum
a connection that joins forebrain with hindbrain. Then comes the third region that is middle oblongata. This region is considered as the posterior most part of the hindbrain and therefore the posterior most part of the brain. Which connects the brain with spinal cord. Moreover, it also encloses a cavity of the fourth ventricle. This ventricle possess very thin, non-nervous, epithelial folds called posterior choroid plexus. This occurs in the form of a roof-like structure. Apart from this, the main function of this region is it is present in various cardiac centers that helps in the cardiac activities, respiration, Control heartbeat, blood pressure, breathing, and other associated activities. 